With Stage 4 water restrictions in Dawson Creek and Poos Coopie going into effect this Thursday, the proposed plans for a new water park here in Dawson Creek may be halted altogether. As in Stage 4, it is unlawful to operate any water toy, including slides and sprinklers. So we're in constant discussion with the city uh, all the time. They've been a really active part of the whole discussion around the water park. Um, you know, and we've been talking to them about, you know, future plans as far as what water use would be. I mean, water restrictions are something that hopefully we don't have continually every year and stuff. But uh, absolutely, you know, it's a big, big concern right now. Kuhn says that technology for such a water park is so advanced that the new technologies for water reuse would mean that they would not have to continually use fresh city water, rather reuse the water that they have previously used. The water goes into the water park, runs through the water park, goes underneath the water park and is then put through UV filtrations again to sanitize it and then it comes back through the water park. So we're actually just recycling the water and through that process we only lose about 15% of water through overspray and evaporation. So then it's very little that we're actually pumping into the actual water park to keep it maintaining. Joanne appeared in council this Monday with an update on the park location as there are currently two ideal spots in competition. This location, which as you can see is a huge open green space, and then the other location um, is Rotary Park. Uh, the idea between the both locations is of course with Rotary Park there's already the water facilities there and it's already a recreational water area. Um, but then the idea with doing it here in Kin Park is the fact that to bring something more central to Dawson Creek and localize it and have actually two separate areas so people can spend time at the Rotary Park, you know, playing there and then also people could come here and do the splash park in the water. Although there will be no slides at this park in the initial phase, there will be many interesting water toys for children. So if you imagine kind of giant mushrooms that rain down water and, you know, big evergreen trees that rain down water, as well as I'd like to have spray cannons. So, you know, you could have a couple of spray cannons located in an area so that the kids can, you know, have little water fights back and forth. If all goes well and the matter of water restrictions are dealt with, the park is expected to become a reality in just three short years. We're just moving along, just moving along. You know, it's a bit a long process. You know, it'll take a few years, like I said, to get it all undergo underway. But we're making progress. In it. For donation information and information on the park's process, you can visit www.communitywaterpark.org. Lindy Free, CJDC TV News, Dawson Creek.